Sup guys, Zektek12 here, and welcome back to Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Today we got a bunch of side quests to do as per usual after beating a major level. We got like a crap ton. First off, Impa's damage control. It's got Luminous Stone. We need some of that. Let's go. I love the Malice Guardians. Now that I think about it, the Fairy Tonic would have probably been very useful for that old Yiga Clan mission that I had to do. That I kept using Impa for. Because it was rarely the time limit that was the problem. It was more or less me surviving. I mean, the time limit was also a bit of a factor instead of me just um, surgically taking out everyone that I could. That was mostly why I couldn't just take everyone out, but... Now I can just use a fairy tonic and just survive better. If I ever need to go back there, because, you know, I need to fight a ton more, uh, Yiga Blade Masters, because I need a Luminous Stone, because apparently that's the only way to get a Luminous Stone. <laughs> Alright, damage control. Oh, great, uh, damage control. Guardian Scout. These Malice Guardian Scouts were only really ever seen in Divine Beasts, because... Um, although they did exist, and they were and they were only at max Guardian Scout one, oh, Guardian Scout two. This actually isn't even a Guardian Scout one. This is actually a Guardian Scout two. So uh, get your facts right. Uh, Kitoy, I don't know how to pronounce your company name, but get your facts right. Uh, game company. This is a, probably the, one of the best places to say. Stasis. Halt. Why did I go stasis? <laughs> Biggest mistake ever. So much work. Still also, work. biggest mistake ever. Me not actually. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, let's try this again. That was also a highly large mistake. Seriously, these Guardian Scouts are actually a lot weaker than I thought they were. Oh. Wanna dodge out of the way of that. Oh, stasis. No, that's- that's- I don't know the difference between bombs and stasis, apparently. That- that- that's- that's a skill that you definitely need if you want to actually be able to play this game properly. Alright. Okay, one's dead. Okay. Okay, Guardian Skywatchers. Whoa! Wanna avoid that. Oh! Zorb symbols. Yeah, yeah, I think this might actually be the, the, my best bet. Yep, there it is. Now give me the symbol. Thank you. I forgot I actually should probably, you know, zoom into things so I can see actually, you know, where all the enemies are. Just a dead guardian right there. A couple guardian scouts. Ooh! Okay, there we go. That this should, this should actually just I, I don't know, will this actually kill them? I don't know. It's time. It did. A worthy adversary. Okay, so this guardian activated, but it was actually caught in the explosion, which is actually pretty nice. Oh, out of the way of that. Okay, which is pretty good because he's already half dead. We know it's definitely in the explosion because his legs are actually popped off. Because if he was meant to start with that amount of health, um, he would still have a hole in his legs. 
Well, then again, um, the first Guardian we've ever encountered in the game in uh, Stage 2 actually does have a couple legs missing. So what do I know? I know nothing, that's what. Rupees are what I need. Um, hello. Let's, let's throw this. Yep, even that is enough to kill these Guardian Scouts. Alright, let's knock you guys out. Okay, def yep, there we go, defend it just in time. Like, I rarely guard in this game. I don't know why, I, I just don't guard much. I've been guarding a lot more ever since, you know, the Guardians have actually been popping up, but... Beat the Malice Guardian. Defend. Oh wait, this is a st Yep, yep, exactly as I thought. Okay. Pick him up. There we go. And there we go, let's- okay. The Malice Guardians, despite their design, are, like, very deadly. Okay, that was not what I meant to say, but, um... Actually, I don't even know if you can even take off the legs of a Malice Guardian. Okay, okay. Flurry Rush. And there we go, that was actually a pretty good Flurry Rush. I- I could've... All right. Now let's take him out. Let's just use our explosive prowess. And seriously, Malice Guardians have crap ton of health. Oh, I actually can take one of their legs off. Yeah, yeah, I can take their legs off. Come on, just shoot me. Just shoot me. I'm defending. Okay, no defend. All right, there we go. This okay. That should that should that should get rid of the other legs probably. Should keyword. That's the big word. It did get. Oh no, nope. There's still one left. And there we go. We can weak point smash it into oblivion. And that should give me a couple luminous stones because I definitely need lots of luminous stones. Like I need six. Which is actually a lot, considering how rare they are. <sighs> Damage control. What a what a terrible job. That a lot of that lot that a lot of companies have been faced with performing recently. It's quite depressing. Oh yeah, last episode I did unlock Master Koga. If you didn't know. Yes, uh, beating that other level did unlock Master Koga, which I just thought was awesome, because it's Master Koga. It's, Ma it's Master Koga. So, um, I hope his training stage will actually get me to understand what I'm sp how I'm supposed to use him and stuff. Zelda's training. Bows. We need lots of electric lizzle foes. Because apparently, electric yellow lizzle foes tails are like the most valuable resource in all of Hyrule. Oh, yes. I actually have not seen that. That image since a while. Like, I have not seen uh, used Zelda. I don't know how long it's been since I've actually used Zelda. It's been a while. I think the last time I actually ever used her was for her own training. Well, with the exception of... It, I'm, I'm more or less talking about before, like the previous level. I've never used Zelda before then. Zelda's training. Bows. Bows. 
rain the arrows of light. The sealing power. I shall seal away your malice. Yes, because that's actually what the purple lines on silver enemies are. They're directly c connected to Calamity Ganon's malice. That's actually something you learn from the Hyrule Compendium in Breath of the Wild. And that's the reason why they're so strong. No, it literally just says that's the reason why they're strong. It, it, doesn't, it doesn't leave anything to the imagination. Silver Bacoblins have appeared. I love these attacks. One thunder KOs. Okay, okay, um... Oh, ZL plus B. Oh! That help. Oh, I actually have to build up, uh, things in luminescent Luminescence. ZL plus Y. And then there's ZL plus X. A bomb of light. I feel like my best bet is using things like Crayonis. There are so many silver bacabas popping up everywhere. The power of the Triforce. Or the Light Force. Or what, seriously, what is Zelda's ceiling power? I'm pretty sure it's the Light Force from the Minish Cap, but I can't be 100% sure. 1,000 enemies I have to kill. Is this just meant to, to help us teach us that uh, Zelda's good for crowd control, or what? You got hit with a beautiful light arrow. Yeah, perfect. Ow. And we weak point smash you. The power of the bow of light. Okay, ceiling bow. Probably not as much damage as the Bow of Light, because I will always remember that that has uh, damage 50, or I will remember for a while. It started with damage 50, and if I ever find a weapon that starts with more than damage 50, it'll actually be better to upgrade that, because that was kind of hard to learn early on. Although I do actually have a way of testing it beyond after afterward. That is a lot of Silver Bokos. That was a lot of silver bocos. Shoot. Five hundred uh fifty-eight enemies have been killed. The power of the light. Seriously, uh, pretty much Zelda has got her um her goddess powers at this point. Like, the way this stage is built is just, it makes up Cryonis, like, super, super powerful. <sighs> There's so many. Silver Lizzlefoes have appeared. You know, I actually kind of, you know, I'm actually kind of starting to like Zelda. Zelda's new ability. I, I used to not like her, um, her mostly her, uh, you know, her Sheikah Slate, um, attacks, because 
They were very terrible for crowd control and damage. And for charging up your special. They were just terrible at everything. But this, um, it's decent for crowd control. It's decent for damage. It's decent for charging up your special because it's decent for crowd control. Um, it's still probably going to take a while to get used to that luminescent form. But, you know, I, I feel like I, I, have a, I have a tertiary. Basic oh, level up, nice. Uh, level 73. The light bomb. Okay, no, you're, you, you need to die. Half the time that remains. Let's let's pull out the Triforce. You know, this would actually be a cooler Final Smash for Zelda in, in Smash. That, uh, pulling out the Triforce, shooting the Bow of Light, it'd be much similar to uh, Link's Final Smash. Uh, well, um, Adult Link, not uh, Child and Tomb Link. Bru the, the Hero of the Wild's Final Smash, not the Young Hero of Time and the... And the Hero of Wind's Final Smash, which are basically the same Final Smash, which I don't think they should have the same Final Smash. And that, and that, seriously, this kind of Final Smash is more akin to a Zelda Final Smash using the Triforce. So we're actually getting pretty close. To be in my luminescent form. Oh, my luminescent form drains my special! Oh! Oh, now I get it! It drains my special! Okay, decent aerials. I thought it had something to do with those rings of light that appear. It doesn't. It just has to do with the fact that it literally just drains my special. Perfect. Silver Lizzlefos. Okay, so we only need to. Okay, we only basically just need to. Okay, kill about um a hundred more. Well, less than that at this point. Apple. Hello there. Okay, let's take advantage of some uh, more crowded areas. Well, let's pull out a bow and just just snipe them. Snipe them directly. Yet that is a lot of kills. I'm actually starting to like Zelda. I don't think I'll ever want to stop. I don't think I'll ever, ever, ever want to use the Sheikah Slate again. Like, why would you ever want to use the Sheikah Slate in the first place? I mean, it does have one unique property in the fact that... Well, um, things that can be countered by, like, bomb runes, or, or maybe other runes, can actually be countered, um, using the basic attacks, which is actually pretty nice. Or at least I know that works for bomb rune, for bomb counterable attacks. Don't know about, I'm not still 100% sure about Kriana, Stasis, and Magnesis. Still trying to figure that one out. One thousand KOs. Nice. All right. Many enemies have been defeated. Zelda's training bows. Victory. Okay, so none of these have got more than fifty attack. We did get a lot of silent princesses and some giant ancient cores. Those things can be very valuable. They sell for a lot of money. 
but I would never sell them because, you know, what if I actually need giant ancient cores? Like, what if I legitimately need to go around and need, use giant ancient cores in, say, you know, a side quest? Okay, another one popped up right next to that. Luminous stone. Luminous stone. Defend the spring of courage. You know, um, if I'm gonna use Zelda, I might as well just upgrade her stuff. Okay, Link, you have a ton of garbage. I could sell all that. Um, Impa, you also have a ton of garbage that I could sell. Zelda, you don't have garbage because I can actually fuse that with your weapon. <laughs> Same with you, Teba. Still at uh, the nice, the nice amount of damage. You too, Yenabo. Oh wait, I forgot. I uh, I didn't actually check to make sure if that was actually a good way to good way. This just by default is already stronger than Master Koga's weapon. <laughs> that's actually kind of funny to me. That's actually that's actually really funny to me. So I'm gonna sell all this stuff because I don't have a use for it. I unfortunately cannot sell the Master Sword. Let's sell all of this garbage. We do not need it. We do need rupees, though. That, that is a lot of rupees. And let's go over and help defend the Spring of Courage. However, I still want to use Link. Show us what you're made of. Um, however, I am going to switch over to Zelda as the second spot. Because I, I actually am kind of like liking Zelda's new attacks at this point. I, I didn't really like them that much at first, but... You know, I, I, they kind of grew on me. Just like I didn't like Impa's attacks that much at first, but then I love hers. Like, her special attack, like, exploitation is perfect for the way I like to play this game. But Link is just a much better, well-rounded character for multi-situations. And the other characters are pretty much just there for novelty. I'm just gonna come out and say it. They're pretty much just there for novelty. I mean, sure, they can do well, but... Not as well as uh, Link, Zelda, and Impa. Silver Moblin has begun assault. Defeat the Guardian and key enemies. Okay, so... Who's beginning the assault? So you guys have made it in here. And I don't want you guys to make it in here. So I feel like this might actually be a good place to start. Monsters inside the northern outpost. I noticed that. And oh yeah, by the way, I actually okay, so um By the way, I actually was able to um complete a side quest and get a link a third um third uh special gauge. And there we go. Weak point smash him. Dead electric moblin. Okay, yep, there are some electric lizzlefos that just want to see your downfall. There's a black moblin. Yep, that's useful. All this rain, all this water. I love water. But you know what I don't like? I don't like sand. It's coarse, it's rough. Okay, it's been a while since I made a joke about that on this channel. Like, by a while, I legitimately do mean a while. Like, oh, the southern outpost. We gotta defend the southern outpost, ah. Uh. Okay, here we have two silver moblins. We should take them out. They're key.
There we go. We freeze them. Okay, how did I get up here? Okay, weak point smash you. There we go. There we go, perfect. And weak point smash you. Defeated. Okay, come on. Okay, so, oh, oh, Zelda's in the area where she needs to be, so I'm gonna switch to her. Yeah, that, uh, so, yeah, Zelda is where I need her to be. Oh! And weak point smash. Using the power of the Bow of Light. There's another Black Moblin. We're gonna take all these enemies out. Thanks to the beautiful power of the Triforce and Goddess Hylia, we shall we shall prevail. There we go. All right. Okay, oh. Mm. Okay, yeah, yeah, I think we could, we could get them down. Monsters, okay, Northern Outpost. Link. Uh, Guardian. Uh, okay. There we go, dead guardian. So this should uh, help us take him out. Iron sledgehammer, got some ancient parts, could definitely use more of those. Yeah, it was actually very difficult to get ancient parts before um, pre-calamity, now it's very easy to get them post-calamity. The only really reliable way to get um, ancient parts is to buy them before they calamity. Oh, there was that one level you could, uh... What's the word, uh... Um, fight a guardian, but... It's a black moblin. Okay, we shall shoot them. No. Okay, after I defeat this guy, I'm coming back to Zelda. Take them out. Let's slice them. Oh no 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 no. Okay, I think it is probably a good idea that I should heal. But there are actually are some boxes. There's a box. Apple. Okay, you're going up against a black Hinox. And a silver moblin, but um, we'll, we'll talk about that in a bit. Okay, Zelda's just kind of moving away from her post and focusing on the direct objective because that's how the NPCs in this game are programmed for some reason. Okay, no, move out of the way and press a no, press A, not X. I don't know why I pressed X. There we go. That's a dead. Oh, Flurry Rush. Um, okay. Okay, ice. There we go. Now we can, come on, come on. And there we go. Weak point smash, and that should deal a ton of damage. Well, it will. 
Okay, that didn't kill him. I literally wish it killed him. Ow! Whoa! Ow! Oh, no, 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 Link. Uh, I think you're gonna need to take on the Southern Outpost. Yeah, Zelda's too low HP. Zelda is way too low for the job. Alright, um, let's head for the southern area. Yeah, let's just get rid of that. No one wants that. That's just a nuisance, more or less. Let's head for the southern. There's some silver bokos we could take out. Some silver moblins. I know that. And I'm going to defend the outpost game. Just, just let me get there, stupid game. Oh wait, Magnesis! Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, okay, there they go. They're, they're, they've been electrocuted. Thank you, Choo Choo. Okay, Black Moblin. Take them out. Okay, I don't know why I didn't give that, that Zelda. I probably should have given that. Okay, there we go. That, that'll take care of them. Another silver moblin. Okay, another, okay, an electric moblin. That's gonna take, need to take a bit of a, a bit of this. However, I can freeze them. That did not freeze them. Come on, die, please. Oh. And there you go. Perfect. There you are. Wait, there, there you guys are. Okay, so let's take out these guys. And then I'm gonna go help Zelda. Taking on that Hinox. That uh, big uh, black Hinox. <laughs> I just realized. Yeah. Rule 34. Get, get, get on it. That's your job. Do your job, Rule 34. Water. This water looks so clear, so clean. I want to drink it. It's making me thirsty. And I don't have a water bottle up here. And that's not good. Okay, Zelda is just getting knocked around like a... Okay, no, that was not Zelda. That was a... That was a Lizalthos. Okay, let's just take him out. There we go. There we go. That one's dead. You're not dead, however. All right, now let's actually go and focus on the last ones that matter. So they should be along this way. Well, they are along this way, but I think this should be the quickest route, is what I meant to say. A lot of choo-choos. Electrocuting the enemy infantry. Oh, that was close. Oh, that's a Malice Guardian! Okay, level up. That, 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 that's good. I didn't expect a level up. 
But I got one. You know, I think enemies are actually starting to become to the point where I can actually, you know, level up. Somewhat regularly. I'm liking, and I like it when I level up somewhat regularly. I just love free EXP. I, I love EXP. That's why I actually go out of the way to kill enemies in this game. Because I just love EXP so much. I'm like, it's like ecstasy to me. It's like any kind of drug. Um, by the way, I'm actually opening up a, um, a program called EXP Addicts Anonymous. You can now, uh, we will keep, we will make sure to keep you anonymous and we will make sure to rehabilitate you and reunite you with your family if they have been separated because of your addictive EXP and murderous urges because of your EXP addiction. We, we will help you out. It, it will, it will, it will. We're, we're gonna start by sending you a little bit of a pamphlet. We're gonna, we're gonna make an entire book about it. We're gonna, we're gonna have an online website. And, and, and we're just gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna help you out. The power of the war. <laughs> okay, I, I, was go I was going way too far with that joke. Although I think that's probably like one of the most well thought out and well done jokes I've ever done on this channel. And I'm kind of proud of it. However, pride meets. Okay, no, I was gonna be like, I was gonna do something stupid, but I've already made a stupid joke, like, literally just a few seconds ago, so. Don't want to double up on it. And I kind of kind of want to keep it up. A little bit paced out. Okay, there we go. There we go. Malice Guardian. Take him out. And there we go. Okay, electrocuted some of them. And there we go, we spin again. And perfect. Okay, okay, there's only one left. Freeze. Your malignant influence shall be purged from you, Malice Guardian. Perfect. Stab right in the eye. That's it. Outposts were kept safe and I killed every enemy. Link leveled up. It was awesome. Defend the Spring of Courage. Victory. Got a bunch of goodies. Got a 55 damage ceiling bow. It was actually great that I got some, say, uh, Luminous Stone, because I need Luminous Stone. Lots of it. I need lots of Luminous Stone, because there's like, well, there actually is one more uh, side quest that I can do to get some Luminous Stone, because that's not the one I'm going to do. I'm actually going to do this one, because that one also requires Luminous Stone, and I want to make sure I actually know that I'm actually going to the right place. Bonus combo for the Bow of Light. Okay, fight lightning with lightning. Why are we playing as Riju and not Urbosa? Well, however, we will get Volt Fruits. This is kind of just another lightning... This is kind of just another anti-lightning training. Except we're being forced to fight as, say, like, uh, Riju. Even though I don't really like Riju that much. I don't like playing as Riju. <sighs> she basically only has one good attack. Her, um... Her... Her Y, 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 X attack, which is um, her just raining down a bunch of lightning. That's basically her only attack. It's good for crowd control. And I mean, her Y, 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 X attack, you know, her tornado attack, that's actually good for... That's actually good for f fighting um, larger enemies that require a lot of health. But um, I usually just end up running around and uh, trying to build up a special for it instead of actually... Yeah, that's what I- yep, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 
And also, yeah, I did mention when I first saw Riju attack like this, that this was actually like, hey, this legitimately confirms that Riju does have her bow spear. This, this does confirm this. Spire just being a chitning of the lightning. Child of the lightning. I'm just moving along. Killing every enemy I come into contact with. That was not the intention. And we shall put on the Thunder Helm. Riju's Fury. All right. No, uh, okay. That 50, that 55 damage ceiling bow, that's actually going to be very useful. Normally the bow of lights uh, um, is actually 100 damage. Yeah, yeah, normally the bow of light is 100 damage in Breath of the Wild. Uh, who, who nerfed it? Who nerfed it? All right, yellow lizzle post tail. Wait, this is actually something that I need. I need yellow lizzle post tails. This is a yes, yeah, success. Uh, many enemies have been defeated. Electric Lionel has appeared. What? There's some still up top. Yeah, there's some stumps still, still up top, and I do need as many. I do need as many as I can get. Defeat the Electric Lionel. That's where we're headed. So I'm gonna just gonna press Y four times. Okay, there's some, there's still some uh, up front. Okay, okay. Wait, I could actually freeze the Lionel. Okay, bomb. Okay, go, no, no, jump back up here. There we go. Um, that, okay, you just literally went through the wall. Okay, that's not what I wanted you to do. I was like, did I see a electric whistle post? Okay, ice. And there we go, we can win points. Okay. That is probably not the direction I should have meat point smashed them in. Okay, ice. I, I tried, it was it was worth a shot. I mean, this thing is called fight lightning with lightning, so that's what I'm doing. I'm fighting lightning with lightning. Come, I need to get... Oh, okay. I there we go. That's what I was hoping for. Move out of the way. Ice. Okay, ice again. And weak point smash. There we go. And Riju leveled up. Nice. Well, that was a bit of a close one. Fight lightning with lightning, victory! Now level 72! 
Okay. Oh, we got wild berries too. Awesome. Oh, we were looking for wild berries, not all about fruit. Yeah, we need wild berries. We need wild berries. We need lots of wild berries. And I'm pretty sure you can buy wild berries somewhere. Yeah. Let's actually go to other parts of the map because that's where we're. That popped up over there. There we go. We need to be able to do this. Now I'm even more charming. No. All right. And perfect. Beautiful work. What? Oh. Ooh. Um, okay. Um. <laughs> what did it promise me? You. Raise weapon level limit. Okay, so I need a lot of fish. Um. Monster parts. Definitely gonna use this. And I have literally infinite amounts of those. <laughs> Level 25. I will raise this one to level max. Uh, use this. <laughs> use weapons. I can finally start making my weapons better. Oh, I cannot get rid of the bow of light. Oh, oh wow. It's like the master sword. I, I actually just can't get rid of it. Level 1170, definitely gonna use this Great Eagle Bow from now on. So, yeah, let's just add this. Nice amount of damage. And, uh... Okay. 62 damage. Um... I don't want to get rid of it. I don't want to get rid of it. I I still want to probably upgrade that. <laughs>